Yo, what's going on, people? It's Jamal Edwards, SBTV, and today we've got another special video. This time, my boy Ryan Taylor, who's a professional BMX rider. Check it out. Jamie Dredd, from, from Birmingham. Nah, from Wolverhampton. Jamie's from uh, Wolverhampton, man. I know, because he sent me a message going, oh, there's this sick kid. There's a sick kid that you need to check out. So he was born and bred in Birmingham, yeah? Warsaw, just outside Birmingham. Just travelled worldwide since I was 14. Got a, I got a flight to America by myself when I was 14. Met some friends out there and stuff. Did you find doing. it difficult being from Birmingham uh, and growing as a professional BMX rider? Just nobody knew anything about it. There was. A, a lot of kids that go to the skate park and videos that we'd always watch of the Americans doing what they do and the big events and the big contests and stuff, but it was never a thing where you'd think, coming from Warsaw or coming from Bloxford, where, where I'm from, you'd never be like, okay, well I can go to America, but then my parents are so supportive when I first started riding. How are you feeling grim at the moment? I've got to show support to my stay fresh years, Safwan, Deadly, and then Obviously, um, Jamie Dredd running the whole show and stuff, but yeah, they're all killing it, man. And it's good to see people from Birmingham as well coming up to the top. Oh, one, two, one. Look at yeah, Lady yeah. Lisa at the moment. She's smashing yeah, it. Yeah, she's smashing it, man. She's coming up. Yeah, she's coming up here with tunes all the time on radio and extra and stuff. So, how did you start riding? What made you want to start? In school, because I was the kid that could never like pay attention for whatever reason. I was, I was in a pretty bad school, to be honest. Um, always had supply teachers. Could never focus, I was kicked out of school in year seven, then went to a different school. I was in there till like year ten and then started doing bits bits and bobs in year eleven. Well, with the wrong crowd and stuff and they used to just go around causing trouble, doing the normal stuff that a lot of kids do these days. Mm -hmm. um, obviously being from an area that isn't the best, you know what I mean? It's, there's a lot of bad influence and stuff. I ended up stealing a bike. Um, going, there was a new skate park that got built at the same time, so we was going to have a skate park messing around and stuff and then they carry on doing their thing. I just ended up staying on, staying on the bike and buying a pair of van shoes and then buying a better bike and stuff and then that's when my mum my my and dad were obviously just like, okay, this is something that's better than what it was doing before. So. And on your path to success, whenever there have been any downfalls and what did you do to maintain self-belief? Injuries are a bad one, but I've been quite lucky. A lot of my friends have had some serious injuries, like breaking the legs and stuff. And to be honest, I've been quite lucky with the injury side of things. But then there's a lot of people that live with fear. I feel like they're the ones that have the most injuries. I just literally live for whatever I want to do and just do whatever I want to do. And what's the future for Ryan Taylor? The main thing for me is no matter how much money I do make or how much I do do for the sport, I just want to get BMX in the public because the main the main thing is football but BMX is in, the, in the public. No, no, no. Football and all these big oh, sports compared to football, are yeah. massive. But what? They don't risk it. I've risked my life every single day on my bike. Even if I go to the skate park and doing little stuff, the little stuff for me is still doing backflips and still doing all the flips and stuff. I risk my life every single day on my bike, but I enjoy doing it. Footballers can go and run around, fall over and moan about their leg being injured. The, the wimps. No. But then BMX is proper, so it needs to get out there. So that's my main focus is just to get BMX in the public. No matter how, no matter how far I go, I just want to get BMX known to the public and just get it out there, man. And just do what I do. I enjoy riding my bike. 